I look at disability as though I'm disabled by design. It's not motor neuron disease that made me disabled. It's the design of things. When people were creating experiences or products, they didn't think about disability in the beginning. About eight years ago, uh, my arms started to become slowly paralyzed and now are completely paralyzed both hands and both arms. People with disabilities are the original hackers. I've had to hack my entire apartment. Everything is on the ground so that I use my feet to cook, to do my makeup, to get dressed. And that's how I've done it in uh, my home. And there really wasn't any fashionable clothing back eight years ago when I became disabled. So I was a late stage co-founder of an amazing nonprofit uh, based here in New York called Open Style Lab. We create wearable devices for people to get dressed easily that are also fashionable. And the coat was very helpful for me. It allows me to slip my head through because they put fish uh, boning, which is uh, a type of like fashion uh, material in the neck. And then I can slide right in and I have a beautiful black coat. With my team, I created a MetroCard reader necklace where I put the MetroCard reader in the attachment of the necklace. I put my neck down and move it to the side and it swipes the metro. One in five people globally have a permanent disability and they have money. That's the big thing that brands don't realize. The disability community has a disposable income of $8 trillion. That is huge. But there's really only a few brands that are thinking about creating products and advertising that represents one fifth of the world. When you design for the edge cases, you create a better design. In cases like that, were the touchscreen, self-driving cars, curb cuts, and the typewriter. Those were all inventions that were created for someone with a disability, but are just better designs and now used by all. I had a really difficult time finding a wedding dress. I wanted it to have pockets because it supports my arms because when they hang on the side without being supported, they're really uncomfortable. And I went to a few designers, very famous fashion designers. You can think of the top five bridal designers. And many of them said, no, we're not gonna add pockets to this dress. They wouldn't alter the dress from its original form, even though I needed it for health reasons. on social media and you see an ad that with someone with a disability and you feel like it represents the community right like it share it comment it because that engagement brings it to more people i think that's a really small thing i think buying from brands that support people with disabilities are very important and then if you work in a creator role making sure that people with disabilities are represented in the ads that you create the hardest part for me becoming disabled was not that i couldn't physically do something it was the preconceived notions that people had about disability. It's that media and brands aren't showing people with disabilities, and when they do, they show them in a very sad way. But I love my life. I wouldn't change, change it for the world.